Hey, Bobby, do you follow Elon Musk? You know what? I don't. Hmm. Why not? I don't know. I, I just don't get how somebody could be so fascinating and so boring at the same time. Yeah, a lot of them rich nerds are like that. Like Bill Gates. You think Bill Gates is interesting, huh? No, I mean, he has come up with some cool shit. You ever see that guy dance? Bill Gates. Yeah, yeah, You could tell a lot about a guy by the way he dances. Hmm. And he dances like some neighborhood kids put a bag of shit on his porch and lit it on fire and rang his doorbell and ran away. And he came out and started stomping on the bag and the kids all laughed at him from the bushes. Hmm. That's what he looks like when he dances to me. All right, take a breath, Bobby. So then how do you think Elon dances? Elon? Oh, fucking sprockets all the way. You see what I mean? Fascinating? Kinda. Boring? Absolutely. I mean, you could dance like that inside a fucking porta potty. It's so restrictive. And that's why you don't follow him. I guess I've just never needed to be alerted to his presence. He's fucking everywhere. Look what's trending. Number one, Elon. Number two is Elon SpaceX. Number four is Elon's kid's name. And what's number three? Mm, number three, uh, X. And then there's like an A and an E mushed together, and then an A-12. That's Elon's kid's actual name. No, that's number four. Yeah, no, I see what four is. Three is his actual name. He named his kid that sequence of numbers and symbols. And riddles, I guess? What the fuck? I hope he enrolls that kid in karate class as early as humanly possible. That A and E symbol mashed together? It's like the Elvin symbol for AI or something. Mm, Elvin? What do you mean Elvin? Like, fucking elves? I guess. You know what? That's why I don't follow Elon Musk. Fucking goofy enigma. You know the parking spot next to mine in my parking garage? The guy drives a Tesla. Hmm. Fucking parks halfway in my spot, I'd say 75% of the time easy. So why don't you say something to him? Oh, I did several times. And he said something like, the laws of parallelograms have proven that two perpetual parallel lines that are in perpetual contact with each other must be equally parallel in perpetuity or some garbage like that. Huh. You know what? That sounds like something Elon Musk would say. It does, right? <laughs> Actually, he looks a lot like him. Exactly like him, actually. Mm -hmm. Elon Musk doesn't live in your apartment complex in fucking Hawthorne, dude. Oh, I know, I know. I'm just saying. It's ironic. Is it? I don't know. I've been trying to use that word correctly since I was an egg. That Tesla truck does look pretty cool, though, huh? The one he smashed with that futuristic steel rock in front of everyone? Yeah. Uh, actually, I got a theory about that. A theory, you say? Yeah, yeah. So I think that clip was taken totally out of context. Everybody thinks it took place during a seminar about that Tesla truck, right? Right. nuh -uh. It was a seminar about that rock. Elon also made that rock. Huh. And he, he wanted to show how strong the, the rock was. So strong that he could even, you know, break a Tesla truck. So, you know, it was actually a resounding success. <sighs> okay. You feel better, buddy? I think so, thank you. No sweat. Sometimes you gotta get things out so you can let them go, you know what I mean? Hmm. Anyway, that truck's a beast. It is a beast, huh? Yeah, if only they could transform into robots. Wait, they don't transform into robots, do they? Absolutely not, Bob. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, that's what I thought. It's not what I hoped, but... I mean, at least I think they don't. Right. If we are talking about Elon Musk. The guy's created a huge rocket company worth billions of dollars when he could have just bought, like, a dick pump or something. Yeah, we don't know for a fact that that's what was going on. Are you kidding? Have you seen those rockets? My cock is less phallic than those things, and it's a cock. Mm, God damn it, I can't argue that. And look, look, look at the way it lands all backwards like that. It's literally pulling out of the atmosphere. <laughs> well, I mean, that might be a stretch. Yeah, especially after using that dick pump. Oh, snap! <laughs> yay, yay! <laughs> <sighs> Has Elon Musk ever put out a line of cologne called Musk? Mm, I don't think so yet. But now that you mention it, it seems like a foregone conclusion. Oh, wait, look what's trending number five. Musk by Musk. Wow, he's really on top of shit. What do you think it smells like? Mm, maybe success? Right, right. Or failure, depending on your angle. Ooh, what if those two things have the, the same, same smell? I'm picturing like a light cucumbery sort of thing, right? Yeah, almost like a zest. Exactly. <laughs> and riddles, I guess?